Welcome, thank you for tuning in. My name is Howard. I'm normally on the other side of the camera. However, this week I'm going to be running through our featured how-to videos. This week we're going to be discussing Lane Trace Assist, uh, which is featured on most of our range, but we're going to talk about on the Corolla. So follow me and we'll go and have a look. Okay, so first thing to show you is where on the steering wheel to activate and deactivate your lane trace assist. It's quite simple, just on the right hand side you'll see a small button with a symbol of a car pulling out of a lane. Uh, all you need to do initially is turn that on. As you'll be able to see in the top left of your dashboard, you'll be able to see the symbol of the Lane Trace Assist system is activated. The other thing you can do to manipulate it and uh, change it as, as your own, if you was to go to the main vehicle settings, which you just toggle on your steering wheel controls, at the very top there you can see LTA, which is, stands for Lane Trace Assist. All you need to do here, press and hold the OK button, it will go into all the options that you can change on the system and you'll be able to see there there are a number of different things and features to turn on and off so the very top one is the lane center now at the minute that's turned on if you were to toggle that off that would basically mean if you used to use the car on the motorway it would no, no longer keep the car relatively centered to the lane that you're already driving in but ideally you'd want to turn that on the steering assist is the actual vibration in the steering wheel once you move over a line without the indication. So again, ideally you'd want that turned on. And the sensitivity as as it looks. So you can either have it so it's extremely sensitive, so the minute your wheel touches that line, the sensors will pick that up. Uh, if you have it on a lower sensitivity setting, it will take that little bit longer. The sway warning, again, is mainly used for motorway use. So again, if you're on the motorway and the car can feel you veering off ever so slightly, it will automatically bring you back in in conjunction with the lane center. And the final bit at the bottom there, the sway sensitivity, again, goes with that sway, uh, sway sensitivity option at the top there with the sway warning. And all you do there is you press the OK button here just to change how sensitive you want that system to be. And that's it. That's all you need to do. Again, if you don't like this function, all you need to do is press the same button again and then it turns itself off. OK, hopefully it helps with your lane trace assist. Please stay tuned for more videos. If there's anything that you need to know about on your car, please comment below. Please subscribe to our YouTube page or our Facebook page. We'll see you soon. Thank you very much.